hi guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new in here i'm kutso and please do join our beautiful family don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell button so you can be notified whenever i post a new video and to my written subscribers thanks for coming back again i do really appreciate it uh, so guys as you can see by the title of this video this is really a highly requested video um i've been getting a lot of dms on people asking me um what do i use for my brows and stuff so i'm definitely show you all guys how i do my brows. Uh, so me being me was like no i'm definitely gonna do a video showing my people on how i do my brows so without further ado let's go straight to the video so i'm just gonna start by showing you all guys um what i actually use for my brows so they are really budget friendly so they're really affordable so do not have to worry about anything i'm using this actually for my brush uh, this is a brush i'm actually using like to brush my brows up and then i'm also using this one it's basically a toothbrush so i'm using it in order to apply um in gel instead of a brow gel because i feel like buying an eyebrow gel is really a waste of money because this can do what it, what the brow gel is actually doing you get and then and the styling gel that i'm using is this one the flex styling gel very affordable that i'm using in order to to line up the brows in order to get a perfect shape and this one is this one actually this one i'm using it um to line up in order to, the brows to get a perfect shape and then this one let me show you please please focus okay i'm using this one in order to clean up the concealers and stuff underneath my oh brow yak for my brows i'm using these ones it's basically two brows so i'm using this one okay let me show you this one and in order to fill up my brows inside and then this one in order to highlight um the shape of my brows you get so this is how it is it's actually a, a gel brow and then it's in the shade let me check it's in the shade hot chocolate don't know if you guys can see mm. chocolate i don't know if you guys can see but then it's in the shade hot chocolate color number two and then this one in the shade brown it's color number two two and then i think i got this one for less than to rent and then this this one is basically 55 rand. okay let me just say it's less than 60 rand pure and the concealer that i use is this one from the fit me product and the foundation that i use is this one it's a, from the fit me products so these that i actually use they all budget free like they all um affordable so you can get them I actually got mine at clicks okay you can get them at clicks um at gas um this came i'm not really sure about Foshini, and i'm not really sure if this cam does have essence products so let's get started i'm basically gonna move you guys closer so you can basically see what i'm doing so guys as you can see my brows i feel like i need to cut them a bit because they are quite big and i do not want um, the big brows like one thing about me now i really like going for an, a natural look you get i think i'm gonna just cut them a bit and then for that i'm using a eraser um, and the scissor i'm definitely gonna use this brush to to brush up my brows upwards you get before i got tweezers i have my mirror right here so i'm definitely gonna cut my brows Oh, I'm definitely gonna shape my brows using my mirror, so I'm not gonna look into the camera. So, yeah, let's get started. So, I'm gonna brush my brows up so they can at least be in the shape that I actually want. Mm. So, guys, whenever um I cut my brows, I really like um lifting my brow, my brow like that. show you all can see the difference between this brow and this one um my brows are naturally shaped so i do not really have to do a lot of work i'm not really sure about this tail though that's not how i want this tail to be so let's try to reshape it again it's better now so next i'm just gonna go in with my my brow pencils 
then i'm definitely gonna start with this one because normally i use this one underneath my brows like i use this one to actually shape my brows the way i want them to be so i start using these ones So normally what I do is that I'm using this um this eye pencil to at least reshape my brows on the bottom and then top I start here. I don't know if you guys saw but then I had not really start at the beginning of my brow. I normally start here. So it can give a natural look kind of thing. Yeah. So let's continue. then in order to fill up my bra inside i'm just gonna use this um i don't have a champagne at all oh, where it is. so that's basically how it looks <laughs> but then it's dark and that's not how i want it so we're definitely gonna try making it um a bit natural i'm gonna go in with my, my first um eye pencil i'm definitely gonna just throw three lines from the beginning so it can be a bit natural see it giving um a bit of natural look not me wasting time child like i can't talk while doing the wig like i feel like i should stop then focus on you guys and then continue after and that literally waste my time okay the next step this is where my concealer and my foundation will come in and then i'm definitely gonna use these three brushes right here just put a little concealer on my on my hand so it can be easy for me to at least reshape this because i don't, I don't want to open Tolela, open Tolela when brushes comes in these ones yeah. so can you see what i'm doing like, i am using this brush to at least um wipe up the the concealer that's left behind underneath my brow so they cannot just look weird our fingers fix everything like if you can just see and then for now i'm just gonna do this side but then get done with this brow though then i just want to do this side so that they can be on the same size like i don't want the other brow to be up and the other one to be down you get so i want them to be on the same side on the same level actually so i'm just gonna do okay guys this is how it came out i did not really really planned the concealer of this brow i did not blend it well but then this is how uh, it came out yeah and then for i'm using the same brush to shape my brow on the bottom and on top like i'm literally using the same brush so foundation comes in to put a little dough not much so for now you go, we're gonna use the foundation to at least shape up the top of my brow and normally I start on the middle to like where the tail actually start. It's 
not giving what it's supposed to give like so for now i'm gonna use my brush the one i've used my brow to at least try to cover up the, the line here the concealer line erase the line see how it came out and then like i'm just gonna go in and try this side too then i'm definitely gonna show you all guys the final look of my brows stay tuned so the last step um this way the styling gel comes in like the styling gel will just literally help your brows to last longer so you definitely just go and it definitely give it a much detailing of the beginning the brow like it, it will literally just show that um you have done something on the beginning So most people prefer using the brow gel before they can draw their brows. Nah, I prefer using the brow after I'm done with my brows. And that helps a lot. Okay, can you guys see the difference between this eyebrow and this one? I'm pretty sure that you guys can see that. Yeah, and then this is my final look of my brows so i'm definitely gonna just put a makeup on so you guys can actually see the final 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 look um of my makeup brows on so stay tuned for that don't go anyway stay tuned for that